Hey there everyone, welcome back to a brand new episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy 7. So, we saved Aerith, and you know, we're gonna go through here. Apparently our home is through here. Ah, what a drag. We're gonna go to that store in Sector 6 again. Huh? Who the hell are you? Who do you think you're talking to? Alright, I guess I, I guess I gotta fight. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, great. They're barking. Lovely. Oh, whatever. We're gonna just, uh... Hey! The antidote was stolen. It's, hey! Give me back my ether. Give me back the antidote. The antidote damage. Oh my god, what are you, a duck? Oh, he ran away with my antidote. No! Okay, so if you don't kill him in one turn, I guess they just steal your crap. That's awesome. Fine. Clearly not that way. Let's go this way. Uh, who are you? That guy in the pipe is a weird one. No matter what you ask him, he only answers with, uh, or ah. You ever hear of Wall Market? Nope. Market in the slums of Sector 6. You got everything you could ever want there. You can get it there, that is. The road's something else. Right the pipe. This guy is sick. He passed out nearby. Someone must help him. Hey, pipe dude. This is the one. Won't you help him? I'm not supposed to help him. I'm no doctor. Yeah. No, I guess not. Hey, that man has a tattoo. I think it's the number two. Okay. I need to bring him like an antidote. There's a store I could buy. It. Ooh, it's a doggo. Bark, bark. Bark, bark. I need to get into the store. Need weapons. Yep. Fighting bangles. And grenades. Uh, by four, I guess. You. Okay, I guess you're not the medicine shop. Little oh, kid. You know where the medicine shop is? Alright. Maybe they're supposed to be sparkly and springy and sleepy, whatever. Aw, uh, poor kid. He wants to get to Midgar. Okay, that's her house. Where is the medicine shop? -a? This place? I would assume. We only trade items for Gil here. Ocean? I did not mean to buy that many. Buy two more Phoenix Downs, three Antidotes, and two Tents. There. That ought to do it. I've got literally every healing item available to me at the moment. Uh, uh, can I give him a potion? How do I, how do, I do? Not sure what I do. I'll figure it out later. I'll probably have it on the screen somewhere. And I'll probably do it later. Right, let's go to Aerith's house. I just ran straight on in like I own the place. I'm home, Mom. And this is Cloud, my bodyguard. Bodyguard? Were you followed again? Are you alright? You're not hurt, are you? I'm alright. I had Cloud with me. Thank you, Cloud. So, what are you gonna do now? Sector 7 far from here? I wanna go to Tifa's bar. Is Tifa... a girl? Yeah. 
A girl friend? Girlfriend? No. <laughs> you don't have to get that upset. Well, that's nice. Let's see, Sector 7? I'll show you the way. You gotta be kidding. Why do you want to put yourself in danger again? I'm used to it. Wow, okay, used to it. Well, I don't know, getting help from a girl. A girl? What do you mean by that? You expect me to just sit quietly after hearing something like that? Oh, Cloud. Mom, I'm taking Cloud to Sector 7. I'll be back in a while. But dear, I give up. You never listen to reason once you've made your mind. But if you must go, why don't you go tomorrow? It's getting late tonight. Yeah, you're right, Mom. Eris, please go make the bed. I gotta decide if I wanted to stick with Eris or Aerith. That glow in your eyes, you're from Soldier. Yes, or I used to be. I don't know how to say this, but could you please leave here tonight without telling Aerith? I think I'm gonna go with the TH. I'm too used to it. Seeing Eris is weird. You need to go through Sector 6 to get to Sector 7. Sector 6 is a little dangerous, so you better get some rest tonight. Cloud? Good night. Oh man. Seem pretty tired. Hmm? I haven't slept in a bed like this for a long time. Oh yeah, ever since then. My, how you've grown. I bet the girls will never leave you alone. Not really. I'm worried about you. There are a lot of temptations in the city. I'd feel a lot better if you just settled down with a nice girlfriend. I'm alright. You should have an older girlfriend, one that'll take care of you. I think that would be best for you. Damn, calling him a kid? <laughs> Holy hell, I'm not interested. I must have fallen asleep. Sector 7's past Sector 6. I should be alright by myself. I got a potion and Phoenix down. As long as you don't go running, you're good. Made it out safely without uh, any kind of interruption from. Oh, good god, the dogs. Without any kind of interruption from uh, Aerith there. But I do, however, want to grab this materia. Cover materia. And the uh, ether. Full beans. Anything around here? Nope, just a whole bunch of flowers. This is where she gets all her flowers from. Yep. I don't need to save right now. Doggo! Oh wait. Maybe what that guy needs isn't that. But materia... Restore. Okay, hold on. So can I equip you with a Titan Bangle instead? And give you the Materia or Restore. I don't know what cover does. Protects allies when attacked. Okay, cool. I'll give you Restore, I give you Heal or Cure. Ooh, uh, uh. 
Uh, 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 okay. Can I cast Cure though? Magic. I don't want to cure Cloud. Why don't you cure this dude? Okay, whatever. Alright, I guess that wasn't it. Let's just go. How do I... Through here. Aha! You're up bright and early. <sighs> I couldn't ask you to go. I knew it would be too dangerous. Are you done? <laughs> uh, uh, are you done? You have to go through the slum in Sector 6 to get to Tifa's 7th Heaven. I'll take you there. Come on. Yeah. Damn it, Earth. Well, you just gotta have to go with her. I do not recall any way how to get through here. What? It's just a house. Uh, okay, it's a house with bombs. Very powerful bombs, apparently. Bonk it. Stab it. Only in a Final Fantasy game can an enemy just be a whole house with no face. Bonk. the house. Actually, not to use cure now. How long does it take for you to die? I mean, that cure is awesome. Okay, there we go. As soon as I say it's, I need a cure and a heal and air. How long does it take for you to die? You die as soon as I see it. Of course. What a shock! I'm not surprised. Just, just, just get out of my way. Down here. Okay, the tunnel to go this way. Oh, it's over here. Rolls. Use them. Not. Okay. Alright, I guess not. So we're just gonna move on. There's nothing this way. Ah, I can climb that. God, these graphics can be a little misleading sometimes. So I didn't think that that pole was there on that layer, so I couldn't climb it. And it's just, oh, hey, you can climb it. The gate to Sector 7's in there. Thanks. I guess this is goodbye. You gonna be alright going home? Oh no, whatever will I do? Isn't that what you want me to say? <sighs> Let's take her home. Isn't that a little out of the way? Yeah, I guess so. Can we take a break? Huh. Tiny little park. What in the world is going on here? Can I climb in there? No? Okay, I guess not. Can I get on the swing set? No. I can't believe it's still here. Cloud, over here. Uh. What rank were you? Rank? You know, in soldier. Oh, I was first class. Just the same as him. Same as who? My first boyfriend. Were you serious? No, but I liked him for a while. I probably knew him. What was his name? It doesn't really matter. It's a chocobo, a chocobo. However you decide to pronounce that, 
it's a, it's a giant chicken. Bird. Huh? Hey, back there. Tifa? What is Tifa doing there? That girl in the cart was Tifa. Where was she going? She looked kind of odd. Whee! Down the slide we go. Wait! I'll go on alone. You go home. Ugh. And there goes Aerith. Doing, you know, Aerith things. I love how the beat changed. It got slow. Don't ask me why. I I'm I like these songs. It's just weird. This place is scary in a lot of ways, especially for a girl. So we've got to find Tifa fast. Yeah. Yikes. Del barrio. Yeah. I just can't make up my mind. Hmm. Huh? What about? Hmm. Don't let me say it. So shop down on the right. All right. So first things first, I'm gonna save. Let's see. Set up here. So first things first, we gotta find Tifa. And the way you do that is you go here. Now, thing is, in uh, this part of the story, there is a lot of mini games to go through. This is Don Corneo's mansion. He's a big shot here in Wall Market. Listen, the Don doesn't like men, so get the hell out of here. Yep. So he doesn't like men, so we can't go in. However. We do have Aerith. Problem is, now we can't go in. So we gotta figure out a way around that. This is where all those mini games I was mentioning come into play. Now, you gotta do it in the right order. If you just send it for me, someone's been in all day, can't hold it. Someone's in here, don't look, okay. I just gotta remember how this, cause I gotta trigger it before I can do anything. And I don't particularly recall. Weapon shop. Hold on, I gotta remember how this works. Cause like, I know you're gonna end up talking to basically everybody here. First, you gotta identify where Tifa is. And I know she's in Don Corneo's mansion. Hi, huh? you too, why don't we get a rest? Beautiful room, how about it? I think you gotta go this way, maybe? No way, I can't go on. Things aren't working out. Between our differences and my pay. Get salty. What the hell? You. Hmm. This ain't no show. I'm busy right now. I'm feeling like there's gonna be a fight. Okay. Trying to fight me, I guess. Man, should I go or not? I get so mental at times like this. I'm hopeless. Hey, aren't you? What? You mean you're. too? Me too, I guess. Your chief was childhood friend, and you brought a new girlfriend to a place like this? What kind of guy are you? Wait, is Tifa here? Honey Bean is a private club, only members can go in and shoot you. You don't fuck with the D's, but there isn't here. You know a girl named Tifa. Hey, you're pretty fast. Tifa's our newest girl. Unfortunately, she's having an interview right now. Here at the Honey Bee Inn, it's customary for all the new girls to be taken to Don Corneo's mansion. Don Corneo's a famous. Dilantet? Dilettant, I guess. I don't know how to pronounce that one. Now he wants to settle down and is in the market for a bride. Alright, so now we know. Like, you had to go here first, I think. And then you have to go back here to Don Corneo's mansion. I think that's the right order to trigger things in. Because when you go up here and you talk to the guy at the front, he'll be like, oh, well, you know, if you had another cute girl with you, you can go in. And this is where things get interesting. There we go. Hey, you got a cute one with you. Hey, hey, no, sorry, whoops, I thought this was cloud time. Hey, this is the Don's mansion. I'll go take a look. I'll tell Tifa about you. 
No, you can't. Why? Do you know what kind of place this is? Then what am I supposed to do? You want to go in with me? Well, being a man, that'd be pretty hard. Besides, if I bust in there, it'll cause too much commotion. But I just can't let you go in alone. Oh, man. First, we need to find out if Tifa's alright. What's so funny, Aerith? Cloud, why don't you dress up like a girl? It's the only way! What? Just wait. Wait, hold on. Just wait. I've got a cute friend I want to bring. Aerith, I can't. You are worried about Tifa, aren't you? Then come on, hurry! And here we go. Time to do one of the most interesting and convoluted uh, series of minigames ever. And I'm going to the full way. Hold on. I gotta, I gotta remember how to do this the right way. Alright, so. We're gonna get all of the best kind of things for this actual minigame to work. Uh, it's not a, a minigame, it's a series of minigames, I should say. So first things first, we're going to go all the way back to the beginning of this place, the wall market, and we're going to talk, we're going to go in here, and I think it's this house, right? The 10 gil per night, I'll stay. Please come again. No. I'm supposed to do this later, I think. Hold on. So, let me see. There's a dress shop in here somewhere. Alright, is it this one? No. No, is this a dress shop? Aha! That's this guy behind the corner. Excuse me, I'd like to get it. Okay, here we go. Um, it might take a little time. Will that be alright? Problem. Well, my father, the owner, has been in a bit of a slump lately. You see, he makes all the dresses. And where's your father? He's probably plastered at the bar. So, you're saying we can't get a dress unless we do something about your father? Yes, I'm sorry. He's caused so much trouble. <laughs> You'd help me bring him back. Well, if we don't do something, we don't get a dress, right? Really? Please help my crazy old dad. I don't know what to do anymore. All right, let's do something. Let's go, Cloud. And we're off to the bar. Which is, I know I ran into it on accident earlier. I think it was this one. Yeah, so we, this old man right here is the dad. Excuse me, or excuse us. Are you the father of the girl at the clothing store? I own the clothes shop, but I ain't your father. I didn't say that. Make me some clothes. I don't make men's clothes, and I don't feel like making anything right now. Cloud, can you wait over there for a second? I'll try and talk to him. Why don't you go over there and have something to drink? You know, mister, he always said that just once he'd like to dress up like a girl. And that's why I wanted to get a cute dress for him. What? A tough looking guy like that? So, how about it? Will you make him one? Might be interesting. I was getting a little bored making just regular clothes. Then you'll do it for us? Yeah, alright. What kind of dress do you want? Something that feels soft and something that shimmers. Hmm. Hmm. I got it. You know, I got a friend that has the same taste like him. I'll go talk to him. Alright, there we go. So here's the cool thing, now that the dress is done, or at least, you know, this selection is done, you want to pick those two options, because that'll make you the quote unquote most effeminate looking. So you'd want that, so if you want to get Cloud picked, then that's what you'd have to do. Oh, you're here, it's ready, go try it on. Alright, we got the silk dress. That is considered the best dress. If you pick clean, that's it. He doesn't ask for anything else. You get a cotton dress. And if you pick soft and shiny, you get a satin dress. 
Alright, cloud and address. How do you put this thing on? Whoa, what are you doing? It's still not right. A wig, that's what you need. Um, wait. Um, I thought you might. So I talked about my friend to. Hmm, <laughs> thought you might. So I talked to my friend about getting one. You know the gym? You'll find a lot of people like you there. Go and talk to them. <sighs> like you. Aerith, what did you tell him? Does it matter? Anyhow, we got you a pretty dress. God damn it, Aerith. Alright, so now, to the gym. So, what you want to do is you're going to head now to the northern part of town. And I think it is this one. Machine gun. Or machine and gun. No. That's the item store. The gym is further up. I was wrong. It's the northernmost part of town. What does this thing say? Hold on. Northern part of Wall Market. So this, I thought this was all considered Wall Market. This building? No. No. The hell? Dude, this is why I, I gotta be careful with where I walk into. Sometimes I don't remember where I'm going. Get wherever you like. No. I'm not going to do that one yet. But that's important. You need to go there later. Aha! Here we go. The gym. Alright, so. Talk to this person. Are you the one that wants to be cute? You. Right. And about the wig. Yeah, I heard it. That it'll cost you. Urgh! Big bro! The only way you're gonna get cute is if you can beat Big Bro! That's right! You've gotta compete with us. That's right. Let's do squats. Alright, we'll beat you out of this gym. Are you... The beautiful Big Bro? What? You didn't know. Always running around here saying Big Bro this and Big Bro that. Never mind that. Come over here. Now, wait, no, I'll explain the rules. In the ready position, push switch to squat, cancel to get back up, and okay position. Okay. So it's switch, cancel, okay. Got it. I got it. Erasmus squats have 30 seconds. I'm not going to lose. Big Rose was mine. Quiet. It's not fair to start. Do you want to have some practice? Yes. literally can't get a single squat in. He had zero squats. No! Do not begin the real thing. Hold on. Hold on. Let me, let me look this up. Alright, I'm gonna try it. Ah, oh, shit. Insert C, X. Insert C, X. X. Insert C, X. Damn it, Cloud. Nope. He had 12. Okay, he had 12 and I had 16. Whew. Okay. Oh, that's a man. Oh, sweet Jesus. I thought that was a chick. Right, I got the blonde wig. Oh, oh man, that was close. <laughs> I didn't figure out what button was the right one first. Oh man, that, that actually had to be scary for a minute. Oh sweet Jesus. Oh man, that was that was close. That was close. Hold on, I gotta I gotta 
I gotta get back to the guide because uh, <laughs> that one had me a little, a little lost for a minute. All right, let's see. All right, so there we go. Blonde wig is the best wig you can get. So technically, you can go with. Oh Jesus! Shut up! Don't cry just because you lost. Ugh. Bro's fists of steel cuts the bone. Jesus. So yeah, you can actually just go straight now to Don to Don Corneo, and get it all done. But there's a few more things you can get to make it even more perfect and more likely that you'll get picked. And by picked is because when you go through this. You, you'll see what I mean. Because, uh... <laughs> Don Corneo needs to pick... Excuse me. He needs to pick a bride. And... It'll be between you, Tifa, and Aerith. He can pick you, which is going to be absolutely priceless because you can make Cloud dress in full drag. And then just completely blow his mind. Otherwise, he'll pick Tifa or Aerith, and then you got to go through a dungeon thing. It's interesting. Here we go. So you can get the diamond tiara, the sexy cologne, but you could also get another thing, which is lingerie or bikini briefs, and you can put them in makeup, which is absolutely priceless. So let's go get the cologne first. So we got to go back to the bar, which was this one, and the woman in the toilet. Okay, no, not that one. Bar is for the north. Here we go. Go to the bar. Gotta talk to the woman that's in the toilet. So she's gonna be sick. Yeah. Don't look. Got any medicine on you? I'm too hyper and ugh. Okay. So what we're gonna do is go here. Go down this way. What you wanna actually go to is the restaurant place I was told you I was gonna be important bef before. This place over here. You want to eat something and then just tell them their food is all right. Sit wherever you like. Well, there's only one seat available. Yeah, let's sit. What do you have? Um, they all cost 70 gil, so it doesn't really matter. I'll do Korean barbecue. I love how that means there's a Korea here. In the store, you pay first. So yeah, it's fine. It's not like Midgar barbecue. Thank you, just a second. All right. It was all right. Okay, the, these are like the mean comments, the two on the other end. You say it was all right, they actually give you a coupon. You can go to the pharmacy. So, now we go there to the pharmacy, which is this dude up here. You go get some drugs. Hey man, got a minute? I need to talk, man to man. What is it? Really? I appreciate it. I'm sorry, but young lady, would you turn away, turn the other way for a second? Why? Aerith. Gosh. I'm sorry, lady. Here's the thing. Do you know what that vending machine, do you know that vending machine in the end? I meant you to know what they're selling in it. I just can't ask a girl to go get it. Why? I buy it myself? Well, to tell you the truth, I got a fight with the guy in the inn and I can't go in there anymore. So how about it? I'll go. Thanks. I'll be waiting here when you're done. Finished? The vending machine in the inn. That wasn't the pharmacy. Can you move out of my way, guy? Jesus, I felt like I was trapped in freaking Shining Force again. Right, the vending machine in the inn. Can I talk to it? Okay, I don't know what that's about, but I'll check it out later, unless he didn't mean here. So, wait, is this considered the pharmacy, or is it the other one? Nobody's home. Beep, bleep, whoa! Broken. Okay, note to self, don't mess with that. This has gotta be the pharmacy, right? That was a pill. Alright, guy. My dude. 
Whoa! Just stand there, say something. I was trying to. Oh, you have a coupon? Then please select any one medicine you like. Alright, I think we need the digestive. Yeah, we need that. So, we're gonna take this. And we're gonna go back to the lady that's sick up here in the bar. You give her the digestive, and she'll give you the sexy colonge, which is the best colonge that you can get since the gamay. And let's the other guy go take a shit. What? Er, give her the medicine. You really give me some. Feel better. Thanks for your kindness. And we got sexy cologne. Now she's strutting out here like she's on business. Now this dude's gonna blast in here, just, just <laughs> ripping a new one. He's ripping. Ace. Whoops. Alright, but whatever. We got that now. So now we need to go to the Materia shop. Which is located north of the save point. There was this one. I already talked to him. Ah, okay. Hold on. Come out, head to the end, stay. At the inn, I guess so I gotta stay there again. Ten gil per night. Yep, that's fine. All right. So the more gil you spend, the better the item you get. So I'll spend that one, get two hundred one. Thank you very much. Please come again. All right, so now if I go all the way back to this guy way up here again, I'm going full out. I'm decking Cloud out. Cloud is going to be Cloudette. I got it. Oh, really? Hey. Jeez. And what was it? A protein drink set. That jerk. I'm going to do so much more business than him. His head will spin. Thanks, bud. I'm motivated now. Take this. It's not much. Alright, the diamond tiara. Alright, so now that we got that, we've got... Can you not? Jesus. Got one more item to grab. Nope, just can't make up my mind. Here, you take this. You won't be able to get in without it. Member's card. So now we gotta go all the way over here. Now that we're a member, we can get in. Hmm. Please, please. Okay, let me in though. Hey, isn't that a member's card I see shining in your hot little hand? Please, come in. Yeah, Aerith, you're gonna have to stay here and... Looks like I need to go inside to complete my disguise. Hmm, sure, good excuse. See ya. Alright. Who? Oh, I mean, sir. Hurry. Please choose a room. Gosh, he's so weird. Then again, they all are. So, we gotta choose the room. In the upper right, this is the lover's room, if I remember correctly, and that should be occupied. Can I look at that one? No. No, I don't need to go in. And this is the queen's room, are both occupied. Queen's room. So this room's being lo uh, used. Lo Sweet Jesus. The Queen's room. I don't even want to know. W wow. What kind of... The wind's calm now. This is like a horror game, Jesus. The curse of the resurrected Satan. Our beloved queen does not awaken. Oh, sweet Jesus! What is going on? The 
Time is ripe. The legend has been passed down through the generations. Shouldn't we stop him soon? We have a luncheon with the President Shinra. You tell him. I can't tell him. Come on, old man. Passed the generations were so disgusted with the President. They sought the promised land. One with blue eyes. And a great white sword on his back. Can a Midgar lay down for this? Will not lead us to the path of the promised land. What are you complaining about? It's just holding the lights. We just gotta wear this heavy armor. No, this is all part of the job. Oh yeah, did you hear the president's wife found out about this little hobby of his? The president of Shinra. <laughs> No way, I didn't know that. Oh, it looks like he's done. Man, I'm glad. Jeez, Mr. President. I mean, Your Majesty. Oh, I'm sorry. Please remove the ancient curse. What the hell? Hurry. Okay. The lover's room. Looks like this room's being used. Sound like somebody just ripped one. Somebody's wheezing. This is an old man. What's wrong, Grandpa? You keep sighing. Um, you know, Grandma. Yikes! Is this the room? I know our son rented the room and all. Too nice for us. Big round bed, gorgeous tub. I can't come. Oh no! Don't worry about it. It's a high class neighborhood in the big city. You keep complaining, we'll get in trouble. Oh no! Alright, we're gonna leave that one. Yep, I know. Pick a room, pick a room. Alright, so. If you. The best combination that you can get is the silk dress, the blonde wig, the sexy cologne, and the diamond tiara. And after that, it doesn't matter. You can get uh, either the the briefs that you can get here, or you can get lingerie. I'm gonna go out full out and go lingerie. Looks like this is unoccupied. I'll take this one. All right, the dude is enter the room. You're not gonna have a change of heart. I'm gonna repeat myself. Oh, don't be angry with me. Yep, yep, yep. All right, let's see which one is this one. You! What are you doing in a place like this? That's what I had to ask you. Should you be fooling around here? You think problems will go away just about thinking about them? Help someone hurry. So, Cloud has a really crazy flashback. You can't change anything just by sitting back and looking at it. What are you saying? It started moving. What has? Wake up! Okay. I'm being rubbed. Thump, pound, thump, pound. Questionable. Poik, poik, squish. Uh, ow! Wake up! My guy! I'm so relieved. Bubby, I heard you collapsed. No, no, no. Don't get up. Don't get so uptight. Huh? Yeah, they say youth is long yet so short. Let's give this next one your best shot. Oh! Yikes. Time's up. Bye, Bubby. Um. Yikes. Cloud's like, huh? I don't know. A lot of adult things going on for inconvenience. Please take this. And we got the lingerie. What, this rag for me? I just don't get it. <laughs> oh no, Cloud. You can't call girls clothes lingerie like just rags. My guy, rude.
Oh wait. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. After the scene, head to the upper room. Have the girl on the left. Okay, here we go. So I do need to put on some makeup. If I were to dress up like a woman, I really gotta prepare carefully. Have them do it. I don't know if you talk to her enough, you can get it. I'm getting tired of this. No more. I'm done. I don't care. Sorry, it's almost closing time. Remember any personal belongings. That's fine. Let's go. Hey, Cloud! Alright, bye boys. Alrighty. So, let's see what I'm at right now. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave this episode off here for now since we got all of these stupid mini games done, and we'll worry about Don Corneo and uh, his interesting situation on the next episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy VII. We're gonna infiltrate the mansion, save Tifa, and probably embarrass Don Corneo in the process. Other than that, guys, I will catch you all here next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy VII. All right. If you liked today's episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you aren't already subscribed, hit that subscribe button and join the Curly Crew. That way, whenever I drop a new episode, you guys are already up to date and already know when I drop it. And it's going to be every day between 2 to 3 p.m., you know, barring any kind of emergencies or anything of the sort. But other than that, guys, I will catch you all here next time. I hope you all have a great and wonderful day.